Hi, this is Artifacts of Mars, and I want to do a Tyranny Watch field report of a different type. This is a good thing. This is 100% good. Uh, local team, I went to uh, Lima Crossroad Days, and I'll show you what I saw out on the sidewalk. I saw that thing out on the sidewalk. I'm going, what on earth is going on with this? Well, it turns out it was uh, from the local uh, school. Most of the kids that were doing this are oh, middle schoolers. They're not really old at all. But they've been putting together this robot more than one robot. This was kind of more of a rover type robot. And the team 2228 Cougar Tech. I saw the thing on the sidewalk and I just could not resist. Uh, I, sorry, I don't have any uh, video. I did take two video clips, so unfortunately I can't get them off my camera. That's a whole other story. I have to deal with that some other time, but anyway. You see the woman in the background, uh, I guess she's like one of her teachers or something. Uh, she's in the tent. This is the one that was in the tent. This is a different rover. They were using it to pick up these uh, totes and put them down and all that. 2228. Uh, Cougar Tech again. Like I said, I tried to get video of this, but I can't get it off my camera. You can see it's, you know, picking up totes and. These are kids that are doing this. This is what amazed me. And this is a good thing because, you know, what we want is to have kids that are innovators and are doing things like this. So this is a good thing. You can see some of the sponsors of Health and Wild GM. Rosa Stanton, whatever that is, Xerox. This was under a uh, tent pavilion. I was actually uh, eating a beast burger when I was t shooting video, so I was pretty far away from it. There's one of the kids. What's with these pink uh, sneakers? Keep seeing those. I guess that's Adidas, if I'm not mistaken. I'm really not up with the time. Times. Alright. That's the, uh... That's all the pictures. Let's take a look at the uh, website. This year's game theme is recycling. It's played on um, 27 by 54 foot field. Robots have to stack up toads and try to put recycling containers on top of these stacks in the scoring zone. Teams can also Try and score extra points by sticking pool noodles, known as litter, into the recycling containers or put in the landfill zone during the autonomous period. The team can move both the autos and recycling containers into a space called the auto zone. Blah, blah, blah. 
take a quick look at this. It probably won't uh, copy over. Okay, Welcome to the 2015 first robotics competition. Video Here's how we song. play Recycle oh. Rush. The objective is to build stacks of totes. Causes me problems when you place recycling bins on top. Two conflicting sound copies. I could and recycle that. litter. The game is played anyway, by two alliances of uh, three teams each on a 27 by 54 foot HTTP field divided into w red w and blue w sides w by a stack. Like there are human player stations in the corners. Each side L is a landfill zone. And um, if you want to look at it, this is on YouTube as well. So this is a good thing. Uh, I'm really proud that these kids are doing this and playing these games and learning this. We need more, more like this and uh, less like uh, teaching them about different genders. There's only two genders. Screw these uh, idiots. So. This is a good thing. I'd like to see more of this. Teaches innovation. These kids are awesome. They're bright. This is a good thing. And I just thought you might appreciate the uh, field report that you know I'm doing right now. Aren't they such a handsome bunch? Anyway, well, they done this was August 1st, 2015. I was not prepared. I just had my uh, phone. I didn't have my regular equipment. That's why I uh, had two videos landlocked. But you can watch videos on this site if you're interested. HTTP www hflrobotics.com That's about it. Uh, hope you enjoyed the video. There's something positive and uplifting for change. It's hard to get that nowadays with everything we have going on, but I did want to show this. I'm Artifacts of Mars. This has been Tyranny Watch News Special Field Report.